Okay, our next performance is um, also someone we hold very dear. Our Salon Hair Salon Hashri! <laughs> So, before I begin, I gotta tell you guys, underneath one of these seats is a $25 gift card to Chick-fil-A. You got 10 seconds to find it before I come and take it. <laughs> underneath one of these chairs. not trust anything that I'm about to say up here. I'm a comedian. I'm going to lie to you this entire time. Keep that in mind. Is that a lie? Probably. <laughs> so, the first thing I need to talk about is my summer, last, my last summer. I spent it taking online PE. And the reason I took online PE is because I really, I really don't like being in the locker rooms. So, I'm going to go back to why I don't like this. Uh, picture me, seven years old, and I walk into the YMCA ba uh, locker room, right? And seven years old, I'm, I'm an immigrant from India, and I'm walking into the bathroom, I go into the pool or whatever, and all of a sudden, I walk upon seven guys that are, that are not fully clothed. <laughs> say that. And... You know, okay, don't ever judge what, why a seven-year-old will do anything, because I broke down crying in front of those people who are, who are just trying to have, you know, get clothed up and whatnot, and I'm, I'm just standing there crying, and they have no reason why this kid is crying in their locker room full of seven guys and who are clothed and whatnot. And so I'm just crying there, and this guy's like, okay, you know what, I, I gotta get this kid out of here, but before that, I probably should pick up a towel. And I don't understand why a 40-year-old man does what he does either, but he asked me to hand him the towel. So he's like, hey kid, you hand me the towel? I'm like, okay sir, I understand you need a towel right now, I, I got you. So I go to pick up the towel, I give it to him, and I'm like, here, take the towel, I'm, I'm just gonna go now. And the worst part about it was telling my parents that I just saw all this happen. And they're like, okay, God, we have... I, we have to pay for your therapy again. <laughs> and, yeah, so that's why I take online PE, and, you know, it's easier to find the answers online. <laughs> <laughs> that is that. <laughs> okay, so, who has a sibling here? A little sibling. Okay, so you should hopefully get where I'm coming from. Okay, so, picture me, seven-year-olds again. You, you've already done that. I was just a terrible child. I don't know why anyone would want a kid like me, but, you know, my parents kept me in grade and whatever, I'm here now. Okay, but here's, here's how stupid I was. I would take the butter, you know, the little butter things, and replace them with jelly, because I like jelly, and the whole family should eat jelly, because I like jelly. And take the butter and put it in the jelly thing, and then, you know, go up to my parents and be like, Oh, you can't believe it's not butter anymore. <laughs> I'm doing all this stupid stuff, and I'm grown up now, I don't do that anymore, I'm only on occasion and whatnot, and now my sister's doing this kind of stuff, and she gets love for it. I didn't get love for it, I got therapy, she's getting love, and I don't understand how that works, but she gets more love than me because she's little, and she's my parents' retirement fund, and what does that make me? Um, you're, you're the cause of our retirement. <laughs> it's like, okay, you know what, you do, you do all that. And the worst part about it is, I see my sister going through the same things that I've been through. So here's, here was basically my adventure buying an iPod. I go, I walk into the uh, Apple store, I pull out my wallet, and my parents are like, no, you can't do that, you're gonna lose your iPod, I don't want you spending money on it, you're just not responsible enough, and... I'm over there crying at the Apple store while the Apple employee's like, no, we don't have an app for that. Okay, I'm over there, and yeah, that's all happening. And 
Like, it takes like a good 10 minutes of crying until I am able to buy the iPod with my own money, right? Let's keep that in mind. My sister. Look, Mom, I got two unicorns on my last report card. Come on. My dad's name, it's her dad's name. We gotta get her an iPod. Like, she got two unicorns. I'm just like, wow, I got straight rainbows. <laughs> and I have to cry for an iPod? Okay. And so this is basically how my family operates. Love goes to my sister. And I don't really have an ending. I kind of had to cut it short because of the time. So, peace out. <laughs>